Dr. By himself. Gengo, a true ring warrior. We've seen him before. He is resilient as ever. This is disgusting. Uh. This is absolutely disgusting. We can see Sauronara opening up that wound on the side of the head of Dr. Johnny Gayton. Crowd getting behind them. Might have, might have uh, suffered a concussion at last week's show here at Rampage Pro oh. Wrestling and willing to be able to come out here for this matchup. And these men are taking advantage of it to them to them, they don't have a heart. They don't show no. any emotion. They've busted open Dr. Johnny Gaten. There's no cause for it. You know, I can understand sometimes when you're in the ring, Tracy, and, and accidents happen because this is a rough and tough sport. You have to be a tough competitor su to survive in the world of pro wrestling, especially here at RPW. But there's no reason to rip that bandage off, tear away the stitching, Tracy, and that's exactly what they've done here. Derringer, the man that caused the injury, now planting his boot firmly right on the side of the head of Dr. Johnny Gaten. And you can see there once again, the double team-like maneuver, basically three on one if you include Derringer. You know, on Dr. Johnny Gaten. there's just no excuse for having to do that to that man. Don't they have any dignity? Don't they have any pride in well, themselves? That's exactly the problem. That's exactly the problem, Tracy. Uh. These men have way too much pride to fill a room here at uh, Johnny G's. Well, they definitely don't have any respect. No respect. Uh, for any of their opponents. And to be quite honest with you, I don't see how any of these men are able to look at themselves in the mirror every day. And you know they do it as much time as they pose in front of the audience. I don't understand how they can look at it right in their eyes, the reflection, and say that they're a man. You can see once again the tactics of this team.